key? Yeah. It's not the key. We lose him? You know what I would love? Something normal. Normal? Yeah. You know, like a speeding ticket, or a noise complaint, or just a fake ID by some punk kid. Yeah, or like a cat caught in a tree. Cat caught in a tree. <laughs> I would kill for a cat in a tree. Uh, a non-reanimated cat in a tree. Why? Hey, expecting a boy or a girl? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ah, ah, how'd you ah. not feel that? That thing is huge. Ah. 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 Get up, get up! Ah. 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 Good job. Where is this thing? You ever notice those things are always pregnant? Where do they find the time, you know? Hey, is it supposed to look like old grandma jewelry? Yeah, the outside looks like we just checked your board and right down. Oh, yeah, found it. That was easy. Hey, are you okay? You've been acting weird all day. Yeah, it's just some girlfriend stuff. Oh, girlfriend stuff. All right, well, I'm good at girlfriend stuff. What is it? No, no, you're not. You're terrible at girlfriend stuff. Are you kidding me? I've read the Art of Karma Sutra 10 times. It's the ultimate guide to romance. I haven't kissed a woman in three years. What? You told me that. You know, it's embarrassing, but I am who I am. I'm sorry, okay? Look, just last week, Megan was late. Like, late from work? Oh, you think she's cheating? Who do you think she's cheating with? Gary? Oh, Gary. I hate that guy. No, I met him four times. Ow! And he doesn't know my name. It's gross. No, she's late. Oh. Yeah. Anyway, it's probably just like her diet or her exercise or whatever, but got me thinking, like, am I ready to be a father? Is that something I could do? Huh. I think you are. You're already dressed like a dad. Ah, it pinched me! Uh, look, I'm serious, though. If it wasn't for Megan, I'd be a total loss. She was gone last weekend. Spent the entire time in my apartment jerking off and watching flash mob videos. Way too many flash mob videos. Honestly, the sheer fact of it, it scares the crap out of me. No. Oh, so were you jerking off to flash mob videos? No, two different things. Okay. Okay. I think you're looking at this dad thing all wrong, okay? There's a lot of awesome powers that go along with being a dad. Like what? Okay, like number one, you're always stronger than everyone. You always get the TV remote. Oh, I have that already. And you always have someone really cool to play with. Oh, I got it! Yeah, get that! I just... I don't think I'm ready. Okay. I'm gonna tell you a story, but you have to keep it between us, all right? Now, remember that time I went down to the sewer to go get that blob thing? Yeah, the thing that looked like a booger? Right, the thing that looked like a big booger with the teeth? Hmm. Okay, I chased it down to the sewer and it cornered me. I panicked, I froze, my whole life flashed before my eyes, and then you came down, and you kicked that booger's butt, and you picked me up, and you carried me out of there. It was really nice. I thought you were unconscious that whole time. I, I gave you mouth to mouth. Ah, uh, I was kind of unconscious. What I'm saying is that it felt real good to be held in your arms. It was very paternal. <laughs> <laughs> my point is that when it was time for you to shit or get off the pot, you shat, and you shat real hard. It's a gross way of saying that. Oh, that's another awesome thing, though. Dads take huge shits. Thanks, man. For what it's worth, you'd be a great dad, too. Are you kidding? I can't imagine anything more scary.